Collingwood Blues radio simulcast. We're here all year long on the audio simulcast. There's a goal to score. Stiles had a bounce shot from the point, and it bounces and finds its way in. And Jack Rimmer, before we get a chance to say hello to everybody, says hello to the score sheet. It is 1-0 Collingwood. Okay, now we have all the hellos in. We can get things underway. Blues give it away in behind the net. Odell in front. They tip in the square. That was a long shot that got tipped in front as well. And a couple of defensemen looking to see if the stick was high, but it was uh, under the crossbar. Gets it across. He couldn't one time at this time. Goes to Andrews again. He'll shoot. Deflected. Got side the score. River puts it in. Off the rebound. Rimmer stick on the ice and the uh, first shot gets stopped. And Rimmer gets his second of the period. Pacina puts it down low. Rimmer cutting in front. Scores! Hat trick! Period one for Jack Rimmer. There wasn't much room there over the shoulder, but Rimmer fires it home in that uh, Niagara Falls goal. Uh, and from the face off the score, I was just looking up the Niagara Falls goal. Fairburn shot, finds its way through, and is 4-1 Collingwood. Who's trying to take care of Niagara Falls, 4-1 the score. Here early in the second period, Styles cuts and scores! From distance, two Collingwood goals this period. Through. Sank Myers with it, long pass to Brendan Goche, puts it down low. Another Goche, score! Power play was over, but Jesse Goche got it under the stick. Uh, Dylan Roach, after that uh, successful season, bites with it now, pass in front, scores! Diodati got that one as the Canucks were allowed to walk in right for the faceoff. And it's all of a sudden a 5-3 game. Really good ones. He hasn't given up anything since he came in. And all of a sudden what looked like was going to be a walk is... There's a goal and a long shot. Joe thinks I gave uh, Wendell the shutout jinx on that one. And Robinson down low, pass across to Basner, pass in front, Bailey scores. Got two whacks at it, and finally slid it home. It is six to four. The net is empty. There's a minute 13 left. Styles goes over to take his man out. Puck stays, and now here goes Rimmer. Empty net for goal number four. Rimmer scores! Started the game with three in the first period. Wraps things up and appears for the Blues with goal number four. Bouncing away from him. Takes it back towards the referee and puts it in between his feet. And the buzzer sounds. Shots on goal wrap up with 44 on the Collingwood side and 36 on the Niagara Falls side. And we're back here Friday night at 7 o'clock at the Eddie Bush on Flow Hockey as the Blues play host to King City. So for Cassie, for Nick, for Joel, for Steve, for Mason, for Mitch, I'm Dale West. Thanks for dropping in, folks.